Throughout my first week back on Twitch, I decided I was going to do a playthrough of FNAF Security Breach for the first time. Now, I know I'm a bit late, but trust me, this video is going to be worth watching. Oh my god! I am a genius! If you want to see me play through the games live, you can follow me on Twitch, link in the description below. While we get started, I think I should explain where this video idea came from. I recently found a content creator that you've probably heard of if you watch FNAF content. His name is Backseat. More specifically, his channel Backseat Streams. He made the video you see on your screen right now. The video title was, Can you beat FNAF Security Breach without seeing a single glitch? After the video was recommended to me and I watched it, I instantly wanted to try the challenge for myself. So what did I do? What any normal person would do, I tagged him on Twitter, asking how long it took. And to my surprise, he actually answered me. He said it took him 9 streams. So right when I got back on Twitch, I decided to stream FNAF Security Breach. I was determined not to see a single glitch. I'm assuming that's a glitch. Yeah, determination didn't really lead to much. So we're moving on. My chat felt bad for me because this was my first time experiencing the game. So they told me to just play it through to completion. So because my chat respected my sanity, I'm going to turn this into a video for everyone else to witness. Monty no, may be banging on the door, but I think you guys should bang that subscribe button. Anyways, moving on. After escaping the feminist duck, we went to the lobby where I was locked in with the furry baits, so I grabbed an entrance pass, stole a magnet. I got I gotta get away from this dickhead before I can finish reading. Hacked the daycare pass out of an ATM and went to go I'm bully the daycare attendant by being a little stink. Oh shit, I'm someone's gonna... angry. All we have to do now is turn on the definitely not a fire hazard play place generators. One, two, Mike three, Ryan. four, five. Now that we've burned the daycare to the ground and we're kicked out for obvious reasons, time to actually enter the pizzeria. After we have this anime friendship mumbo jumbo moment in front of a fountain. What was that? That is a fountain. A fountain is a decorative reservoir used for discharging water. Once we get into the main atrium, we instantly try and vent. We ratio mini music man in a foot race, and right after that, we run right into a security office. We grab a security badge number two and make a this pizza for the bird. Loves teleporting all over the pizza place. Now that she's dealt with, we can leap. God I just damn it! They changed the, the passcodes again. So we got to return to Freddy by abusing Chica's voice box. Oh look, we've made it through the kitchen. What do we find? White woman jump scare. Don't touch me there, that's illegal! Wow, some people. She didn't even call me an Uber. Forget that, let's find Freddy. God damn it. I left you alone for 10 minutes and you died. Thurisel could never. How did I get in the control room? Through the power of editing. So now I just press buttons. Oh look, Freddy's done being a wimp and he's coming to pick me up. So why do I have a bad feeling about this? God damn it! This part of the run took me way too long. The animatronics just wouldn't leave me alone. Death after God, death mommy. after death. Finally, I had some luck and was able to finish this part of the game. After... 40 minutes. Go ahead, roast me in the comments. I deserve it. After I was bullied in the atri... 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 Fuck it. After I was bullied in the main area, we ended up near parts and service, where our fat bear got kidnapped. So like any normal 10-year-old, we have to save him by using our brain and unprotected keycard. Yep. For a building with a shit ton of security, they have a hard time keeping security cards secure. Anyway, now we're at the toughest part of the game. Clicking from memory, which I completed every time. Shut the fuck up. And now we have a moist Freddy. Now that we cleaned up our dog, we wander into the teleporting 12-piece KFC value meals room, where we steal her gaming ticket of awesomeness, which we use to enter mini golf instead of laser tech, because I'm a Chad, and that's what we do. Considering we're in the golfing area, why not steal a camera? And a ticket into the maze, I guess. Not gonna question why both things were in that one office. 
And now we're at the maze controls, which I also did the way it was intended. Shut up. Oh my god! I am a genius! Because I used my Omega Brain to get through the maze, we were able to crawl through yet another vent so that we could meet Monty. And we left what I thought was a very good first impression by, uh, murdering him with a bucket of balls. So we rip off his hands and run down to parts and service. What? You think I'd fail this? I would never! <clears throat> anyway, now we have access to Roxy Raceway, where we grab a robot head and a dance pass. You can never just stay in one place for too long. I gotta run up to the Fastcade now. After entering the Fastcade, we quickly find the security office and... They really need to pay their electricity bill, cause this is the second time tonight that this has happened. So to reset the power, we went to the breaker next to DJ Music Man, and then we had three more to do. One, two, oh, three. And, and we have to download their software update. They should just hire me as an employee, cause I keep doing their job for them. We flipped the switch to cause the update, and Music right. Man was not happy about that. So he started chucking arcade cabinets at me while I ran away from him. Now that we fixed the head, we can go for a nice calm drive. Let's beat the share of the fox! Well, um, I guess I'm eating robot fox for a week. We steal Roxy's eyes and ran through her trap house. Exiting through, you guessed it, event. Now it's time to go back and see my old pal memory game. Which we beat first try, definitely, 100%. Don't roll the clip, don't, I said no. Fuck! Oh, would you look at the time? It's 5.50 in the morning. Which I'm means it's time to take one last pizza run pizza through the pizza plex and say right. goodbye. I can stay?! Right. Freddy gave me his party pass and I went to Fazer Blast to grab the badge and the Bonnie Bowl ticket. We ran all the way up to Bonnie Bowl to grab Monty's ice cream. The secret is the pizza flavor. And then we had to run all the way back down to the basement where we bait the chicken into the trash compactor. She drags us down to the sewers, so we steal her music box to get revenge. That's right, take that bitch! Now we're running through the sewers to try and make our way back upstairs. And it would seem that Chica has been resurrected and is attempting to bully me. But we managed to hit the three generators and made it into the sticky note there room. We go. Editor, play hype music. I said hype music. It's time to finish this once and for all. Memory game, I'm coming for you and I don't plan on losing this time. You lied about winning before! Editor, roll the epic montage of me beating the memory game. We ran through Roxy Raceway for the last time and went down a sketchy staircase. At the bottom of the stairs, there was an elevator. We went down the elevator risking our safety in the process and found a completely different pizza place. We enter the building Die. and go down the hole in the middle of the floor. I, I'm gonna be pissed. Huh. I didn't realize there was a save point that I could use. We met the blob and ended up falling through the floor that he was sitting on. This is it. This is the final boss fight. This is the sign we made it. And now there's only one thing in my way. Tentacles from the plot of a certain anime. They pop up through the floor and they kill me. But even with that little setback, we still managed to beat Burn Trap and finish the game. We did it! Now let's hope I don't get jump scared by the damn tentacle! I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe down below. Maybe drop a comment what you want to see next. But with that being said, I will see you all in the next video.